first and foremost, we like the euro lower. Um, we do have some minor European data today. Spanish unemployment, Centex investor, um, PPI out of Europe. These are all secondary. Um, but rates are higher in the U.S. You can see uh, long bond is now yielding 312, uh, 10 years yielding 276. Uh, we have a couple of tails here on the dailies, and we got the ECB coming up on Thursday. So we like euro lower. Uh, it's been a patient trade. We were long, we were long dollars pretty much all day Friday. Um, no, no real joy on that, uh, but we're still long long dollars in Swiss francs from Friday. So we like Euro lower. You think you can sell this between 60 and 75 today. We're looking for a move down to sort of 40 uh, or 30. Nothing nothing crazy. Vol has obviously been crippled. So you have to sort of think in smaller terms as far as trades and ranges for the day. Let's move over to dollar Swiss same type of chart you have this little line driven drawn here that a lot of people have drawn obviously you don't really want to break trade dollar swiss uh it's not really that good for break trading but sort of one through one double oh ten let's call it and then ideally through these highs here one double oh twenty uh this becomes interesting here it is on the dailies uh inside day on friday and so now we're just kind of waiting to get some fresh air above these one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight daily highs. So keep an eye on that. Let's go to stocks. Uh, obviously, the trade deal is supposedly sealed, signed, sealed, and delivered. So here we are at the moment of truth. The high's been 1975 today. We still have our downside structures on. But today we're going to put on tactical shorts uh, in, in good size. So we're waiting for some sort of negative price action on the hourlies. Uh, but it looks to us like there's going to be some sort of move above 20. Um, and it could move, you know, all the way up to 50, right? It could go up a couple of percent. So you got to keep your powder dry here. Um, but we do like this lower now, now that the news is out. Obviously, on Friday, there was a whiff of this. Now, today, it's out. Uh, we believe sort of buy the rumor, sell the fact is going to come into play here. And we are going to put on a tactical short today. We have our medium-term shorts on from last week, from right around. We put those on right around the 2808 level. So they're a little bit underwater. Um, but we're fine with those. Uh, they're through options, so the stops are embedded in the product. Um, so, but today we will be putting on tactical uh, short contracts on the E-mini futures. Euro yen still looks bid. Uh, we're watching boons here. We don't really have a trade in this anymore. We did not give it, get given any euro yen on Friday, uh, but it still looks bid. We're not ready to fade this at all. You see, boons are still uh, very offered. Uh, One sixty-five oh eight. This is probably a sell today up up near 40 or 50. Um, this looks like the beginning of a big change in trend. Uh, boons lower. We like boons lower tactically and on a medium term basis now. One last thing uh, we'll talk about is, well, let's talk about this CAD yen. We picked some of this up foolishly in the 50s um, on Friday, but we caught it here at 25. This looks like a very serious turn bar. Didn't quite bearish in golf, but massive rejection through the 200 day. Uh, Cadian suffered double whammy, oil got crushed, and Canadian numbers also were terrible. So, BOC is Wednesday this week. Keep an eye on this. You could probably sell this today. Um, but we cut our attempted longs here. For a 30 point loss, which is a terrible trade. I don't know what I was thinking there, but um, just wanted to mention that. And finally, Aussie, we have the RBA uh, statement tonight. So, 
keep an eye on on uh, on Aussie, and if you have an Aussie position, uh, that'll be 4:30 Tuesday morning Swiss time for the RBA statement. All right, I've said enough. Uh, Core short euros is the way today. Uh, we'll be focusing on that as well as long dollar Swiss, which is effectively the same trade. Um, I wish you guys luck and much profits. Talk to you soon. Ciao.